Something complete. Just in the mind can't compete. Ni hiku ichi wa ichi demo zero. Superman yori kimi taki ga ma hero. Human no kotae kokoro no kate kimi to job. It's really good job. Take your attack and the body can stop you. Is that? Bang it your boy Chan once again with another reaction video. And today we'll be diving right in to Wasas. I think this is her third solo song so far, title track or like an album, mini album. Um, from uh, this is I think from Guilty Pleasure, the the album uh, EP. I mean, so it's just a mini album, and the title track of that is I'm a B. So, hmm, I've researched what this means because literally it says I'm a and then character B I think in Hangul it has double meaning the first one is you know she's a B and second this B stands for bit in Korean which is light so dual meaning uh, I'm quite intrigued so let's just go right in with was I'm a B let's go I'm a box. I'm a box. I mean, I think this is the second was a video that starts with backstory. And people laying on the floor <laughs> in the intro, giving me a continuation to Maria. Oh, wow! Wasn't expecting that drum, drum beat. That fish eye shot. Is that tape? Long fingers giving me solar solo vibes. The beat It's creeping up on me I think this is my favorite shot Broken tires I'm pretty sure this video is full of deeper meanings as per like every who has a title track Dance break? Very traditional dance break The guy on the instrument is killing it. What is this transition? It's like two different songs. There's no there's no transition really. I'm a 
just playing snakes black mamba kuangya confirmed <laughs> what's up okay 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 I, uh, here are my thoughts on the song and the music video I think first and foremost let's talk about the song I think in terms of Huasa solo title tracks at least uh, starting it off with Twit I enjoy Twit it has a groovy vibe second I think it's Maria I think this is just the third solo title track of Huasa so I think this is the culmination of those songs because we're getting some elements of Twit um, with the groovy instrumental at the background but overall the prominent vibe here is uh, such a that's continuing from Maria which is kind of slow um, kind of serious uh, flaunty atmosphere vibe um, and I think it's I I'd, I'd enjoyed it I think there's nothing bad to say about the song um, it really fits well with the concept and Wasa's image as a whole um, and as for the music videos, uh, I think I still prefer Maria because of the literal, I think it's term, in, in terms of the camera movements and different scenes. Here it's just like uh, we have a vertical scene or a horizontal scene where was is in the center and there's backup dancers. I think that was a little bit repetitive. Um, the uh, don't get me wrong the background the outfits are changing but it's still a, sh a still shot of that particular scene and well compared to Maria I still uh, like Maria better but um, giving me twit vibes with a lot of uh, double meanings hidden meanings theories for the fans to talk about and discuss but overall uh, it's a good music video it really meshed well with the song um, it complemented well and overall I think Kwasa as a soloist is very strong I think she's the most strongest or the most prominent in terms of uh, Maomu members in portraying a specific uh, concept that is I think generally well embraced by uh, the listeners and the general audience um, she's um, gearing towards a more poppy concept and an atmosphere vibe rather than those uh, I think more experimental uh, member solos so I think I'm a B Huas is a B this is an A this is an A plus I think and I think that's about it. This has been your boy Chan signing off. Like the video if you haven't. Subscribe if you want to. Comment down below what do you want me to react to next. And this has been your boy Chan signing off. Annyeong and peace out. Stay safe everyone.